Dome Theater. And speaking for the Dome are owners Byron and Chelsea Sears. Tonight, we're excited to be able to have this event in our theater. Um, one thing that we've been able to do um, as owners, we feel, has been to extend a variety of films, um, bring them to the big screen in, in Libby, um, but not only just with the films, we've been able to do special events like um, our fundraisers, where we um, host a movie and it's by donation. We've raised um, generally. Uh, up to you know thousand dollars or more for uh, various fundraisers that we've had. We have one coming up for Paint It Pink. I think last year it was thirteen hundred or so for Paint It Pink. So um, that's a really cool option that we love being a part of. Um, we are trying to you know do things, um, a variety of things to get uh, the community in here, like our Throwback Thursdays, which are really old films, but they're classics and. If you've seen it, then you know you love it, and it's it's just kind of a different experience to see it on the big screen. Um, our Christian films that we've been able to bring in, um, they the quality of Christian films are getting getting better, and so we like being able to bring those in for the Christian community. Um, we have had a play here before, the uh, Kootenai characters. I'm going to say they uh, pitiful players. Pitiful players. Yeah, they had a um, a play here one time with the little kids, and it was really fun to to do that. So um, those are kind of a variety of things that we do, but we're not limited to because it is a, a community venue. So uh, one a few things that we have thought of for future projects, um, we've kind of you know bounced around is doing a Lincoln County Independent Film Festival where. Uh, community members um, in Lincoln County, so it's not just Libby, it's Eureka and Troy, would submit independent, um, and it's not, not just like films, it could be commercials or a documentary, they went out and filmed while they're hiking or something and would submit it and we could um, do a big film festival day where we show everything and we could even do like People Choice Awards and kind of stuff like that. Um, we have talked about doing dome membership VIP passes and some of the bigger theaters will do that where you can buy a membership for X amount and it, you, that gets you like six months or a year of movies. Um, we don't really know what that would look like but that's just something that we kind of kicked around. Um, an open mic night we thought would be kind of fun. Um, especially with the younger teens, there's not really a, a, a lot of places for the younger kids to hang out. So. Um, we've done an open mic night where they can come do a comedy show or um, there's a lot of really talented musicians and singers uh, in our community so then being able to kind of showcase that would be really cool. Um, or a talent show. We thought that would be kind of fun on Lincoln County talent show um, to be able to host that. So. Um, and some of the challenges that we faced, well obviously you know um, being a one screen theater we show one movie at a time. So uh, a lot of people will drive 90 miles to go see the latest films in another town, or we have the issue also of they will wait until it's out on video or Netflix. So um, those are a few challenges that we face is kind of capturing the audience to come in and watch a movie here. Um, but it's, it's different watching it in um, your old local theater versus at home. It's just a, a different experience. So um, we, we just really try and keep that variety for the community so that we can keep attendance because um, that's really the only way that we can continue to operate. So uh, obviously, but I'm not as short as she is. Sorry. <laughs> We're probably just about out of time. I just want to make sure, can everyone hear okay? Yeah. You can, okay, because I'm in charge of sound and I may have done a really bad job. <laughs> uh, I only just wanted to say one thing and that's just thanks to the chamber. We have a great chamber of commerce and they're, they're doing things like this 
that you know we we just um, we really appreciate. You know, this crowd of people in here, they've bought popcorn from us and things like that. So we appreciate it. Just wanted to give the chamber a round of applause for that. Any, other than that, any questions for us? Well, not a question, but I just want to thank you guys for the Throwback Thursday. Those are awesome. We're looking forward to watching Lost Boys next yeah. Thursday. And one of the things, if you haven't been to a Throwback Thursday, is they're also trivia night. So yeah. you get to listen to me talk way too much. And, and my wife picks out some really cool um, prizes based on the movie that we're watching. Yeah. So. We give stuff away. That's the yeah. thing. We love our Get community out here. so Come much that we're always treating you guys stuff. So okay. another reason to lock our doors. <laughs> Any other questions? <laughs> Nick Rains, you look good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, thanks.